what is up everybody hope you're having a wonderful day i wanted to talk about the length of tactics ogre or how long it is to beat the game i wanted to know your guys's input like how long you've played the game how much time you've put in is it a very long game is it a very short game is it average you know what what can a person expect that's gonna buy this game the value the content they're gonna get out of it well, I want to go over my experience and what I've seen, and like I said, let me know your guys' if you've played it, how far you've gotten, if you've beaten it, how many hours you put in. But basically, you could beat this game if you really wanted to, if you were just doing the story, you don't care about extra content, you don't care about farming anything or doing anything else. I would say you could beat this game in 30 to 50 hours very easily. I think that's very possible. I think it's very reasonable, and I think that's probably what... A good majority of people do with games like this i think a lot of us are in the majority that really heavily deep dive a game play it for hundreds of hours you know try to get everything try to do everything and i think that has to do a lot with just the amount of games that come out nowadays a lot of people are adults you know it's way more common you know 20 to 30 range 40s you know that's the age group that plays a lot of games and you know you have families you have kids you have a wife you have whatever responsibilities a job you're going to college you know so you don't have a lot of time so when you get a game you just want to get through it get through the meat and potatoes of the game you know the main part and then move on but what makes tactics ogre especially tactics ogre reborn such an amazing game is you could play for a hundred hours and still not beat the main part of the game if you do a lot of optional stuff grindy stuff getting extra things 100 hours and you still didn't beat the main story now you could also do 150 to 200 hours most likely beat the story but have a plethora of just extra content post game content optional dungeons new storylines kind of you know things like that and that's at the 200 hour mark and you could also hit the 300 hour mark and still have things to do heck you could hit 500 hours and still have not done or seen everything in the game. And that is a true thing. That is actually a fact. You could play for 500 hours and not see everything, do everything, unlock everything, experience everything. Especially if you're going to go through the story multiple times on the different routes. That is insane gameplay value. This game is not a live service game. You know, it doesn't get updates. It's just one game. Can you imagine if other games did that? If they just give players the option? You know, I know people sometimes like a shorter game, a quicker game, and that's fine. But if you gave people all this optional content that they wanted to play, they could, and just get more value, more time for their money out of the game, that is insane. That is such a good proposition. I like to look at games every dollar per hour is a good investment. So if you pay 60 bucks for a game, you put 60 hours into it, that's pretty darn good. I mean, you go to a movie these days, it's like 10 to 15 bucks just to go see the movie. And if you get popcorn and a drink, you're looking at 30 bucks to go watch an hour and a half movie. If you're lucky, it's 90 minutes, you know? So value for entertainment on a game is very important. And I really feel Tactics Ogre gives that. And it is just a phenomenal game. It is one of the best games I've ever played. And I really do think you can get a lot of time out of this game, or if you just want to play it for the story and the game, you can still get a good decent amount of time, and it's an enjoyable experience. But like I said, let me know what you guys think. How long would it take you to beat it? Do you think it's good value for money? You know, do you wish other games did this? Because I know I sure do. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one. Until then, later guys. Peace out. Have a good one. Later.